It's just one drink while my parents are gone. What's the worst that could happen? Who are you? I'm your conscious one. Let me tell you that that drink is your gateway to misery. Gateway to misery? Gateway to misery, meaning you're more likely to do heroin, cocaine, and marijuana. And how are you supposed to be a good doctor when you're always getting high? Please, I'm not going to be getting high. And FYI, I'll be a great doctor. <laughs> okay, let's study. So, number... Oh, you want some? What? No, maybe this is 21. You need to put it back in the house. Come on. Come on, nothing. Well, go be your boring self somewhere else. Boring in bed. What? I said nothing. I mean nothing. Wait, Sarah. Oh, I'll forget it. What do we need to talk about? Have a seat. It's about my friend Melody. What about Melody, dear? Well, I was at her house and we were studying, and then she offered me a drink. Mm hmm. And I don't know what to do. Oh my. Again. We should go talk to her. Do you want to go talk to her with me? Okay, let's go. She's gone. You did do something. You came and got me. You did everything you could. This was not a true story, but it was to tell you how drinking can not only affect you, but it also affects your friends. 5,000 people under the age of 21 die from underage drinking. 274 Americans die a day from alcohol-related accidents. Most of these people get alcohol from their friends. So remember to rethink your choices. And if you see anyone with alcohol or jokes that they shouldn't have, text I got it. Two seven four six three seven. Rethink your life, your, your choice. choice.